we could we could also point out, I suppose, that the evidence that relatively unconstrained government spending produces inflation seems to be incontrovertible. And then we might want to discuss exactly what inflation does to people. So inflation makes each unit of currency purchase less units of value. Too much money changing too few goods. Is exactly, unusual. exactly. And then you might say, well, who does that punish? Yeah. And the answer is, well, inflation punishes people who've been wise enough to yes. forestall gratification. Yeah. Right? So if you're somebody who has been sensible and taken the medium to long-term in account, into account, and you've saved money, so accrued wealth, let's say, and the sort of wealth that enables you to have a house and an air conditioning and some opportunities for your kids, we would generally regard that as a social good, right? Because we hope that people who are not profligate and impulsive 